My name's Jennifer Benson. I live in Glendale and I'm a member of the Chevy Chase Garden Club. And my career in art began a long time ago when I was in college. I didn't have enough money for a camera. So I bought a box of paints and some paper because I used to go backpacking in Arizona and every time I would stop at a beautiful spot and look at the mountains or the desert, I wanted to take a picture of it and having no camera, I did a painting instead. So that, I've been watercolor painting for approximately 40 years. My art project is the California Oaks's art. And I did a web search and I located an article about California Technical Institute in Pasadena and how they have a 400 year old oak and they're worried about it because it's not, it's not doing too well. So I contacted Caltech, I met with them and I began, began my first oak tree. I painted the Caltech Engelman Oak, which is the type of oak it is, and it's right by the administration building. I did several paintings of the Engelman Oak so that Caltech could pick which ones they liked, and that was my first commission. Then I decided, I did another web search, I said, well, wonder what the oldest oak is. So I found an oak tree, it was 13,000 years old. That means it's been around since the Pleistocene age. That oak tree was located in Riverside. The next oak tree I painted was the Oak of the Golden Dream. This is the painting right here. This tree is located in Placerita Canyon. And there's a story that goes with this. Francisco Lopez, who is here, or represented here, fell asleep, and while he was sleeping, he dreamt of gold. He just wanted some gold. And he woke up, and he was very hungry, so he pulled up one of these wild onions right here. And in the, un the roots of the onions were nuggets of gold. And this is, was in 18, I think it was eight, in early 1840s. And this predated the gold discovery at Sutter's Mill. So gold was actually discovered in Southern California before it was discovered in Northern California. Another interesting historical piece of information about oak trees is in South Pasadena in the turn of the century around the 1900s, there was a utopian society that was developing and they had their own street called Chelton Way. And in the middle of Chelton Way were many oak trees. And in keeping with the environmentalist of that time, they paved around the oak trees and the oak trees became part of the street. In addition to doing art, I'm also president of a San Fernando Valley Art Club, which is a rather large group of artists where we go on paint outs, we hang our art in galleries. I've been in several galleries and I've won a few awards for some of my oak tree paintings. I've been published, I've had some of my artwork on covers of uh, print material and um, I'm always looking forward to whenever I can paint something and do something more. When I'm painting, I love to be in my studio and listen to classical music. Beethoven is my favorite composer. I think he composed music like an artist would with a brush of notes. <laughs> <laughs>